Good morning, distinguished guests, proud families, friends, and the graduating class of 2017. I would first like to extend a warm and hearty congratulations to all the graduates of 2017. We all made it through. I'm here before you today representing the most wonderful class that I have ever been a part of, the LLM class of 2017. Graduating experience is very different for all of us, as we have managed to finish law school once again, but this time in a different country, thousands of miles away from our respective homes. You know, when I sat down to write this speech, the very first thought that crossed my mind was the concept of Vasudeva Kutumbakam, a Sanskrit phrase which means the world is one big family. My time at Boston University as an LLM student enabled me to experience and live this beautiful concept of universal brotherhood. The LLM class of 2017 comprises of students from all around the world, and I'm proud to say that we now have a global network of lawyers, most importantly, a global network of friends, one big family. We have made innumerable plans to visit each other's countries, and with an insider to take us around, it will be so much more worthwhile. And I'm sure you guys are going to be proved to be the best tour guides ever. During the last year, I had the opportunity to interact with people from China, from Bulgaria, from Venezuela, France, Argentina, Saudi Arabia, Thailand, and the list goes on and on and on. I realized how diverse yet interesting each of their culture was, and yet all of them had one feeling of oneness in it, a sentiment that is unfortunately being torn apart in the present world. I cannot begin to describe how many of my pre-existing biases have been corrected because of my interactions with my wonderful classmates. I hope I have been able to clarify some of their biases about India too. Like, not all Indians are IT experts, and Bollywood is not a dance form. <laughs> the very first lesson that I learned from this program was to have an open mind when interacting with people from diverse backgrounds. That is, as they say, never judge a book by its cover and to ask questions when in doubt, and never rely on hearsay. I strongly believe that some of the most complex problems facing mankind today could be solved if people from diverse backgrounds came together. You know, growing up in India, English was always my first language. But when I started school at BU, I struggled with some of my assignments and my papers. There were times when I doubted myself. And in those times, I turned to my classmates for inspiration. Some of them were pursuing a legal degree in a language relatively foreign to them. Yet, they were transcending language barriers and acing it. Hats off, guys. A big cheer to all of you. Thank you for inspiring me each and every day. The thing that I will miss the most will be the countless classroom discussions that I was a part of. Thank you, professors, for providing us a platform to voice our opinions, questions, and inhibitions. And thank you, classmates, for providing the most intriguing and unique perspectives. Our classroom discussions have empowered us to in understanding the American legal system but it has also opened our minds towards the practices and interpretations of law in other countries. Finally, I would like to take this opportunity to extend my gratitude to Dean Maureen, to Associate Dean Riccardi, Associate Director Maureen Tracy Leo, and to all our professors and support staff for being so very patient with us 
and supporting and guiding us during our LLM journey. Thank you, professors, for understanding our rhythm and providing us guidance accordingly. Your support was truly valuable to each and every one of us. I would also like to take this opportunity to thank our JD counterparts for all their support, especially the ones before the exams. Thank you so much, guys. On behalf of the LLM class of 2017, I would like to dedicate our LLM degrees to our families, friends, significant others. Without your support and encouragement, we would not be here today. Thank you so much. <laughs> Finally, I would like to quote respected alum, Martin Luther King Jr. and say, Darkness cannot drive out darkness, only light can. Hate cannot drive out hate, only love can. On that note, wish you all a very happy and successful life ahead. Reach out, reach high, reach beyond, and let's strive to make a difference.